Uh, hi everyone. Uh, we're back in my home uh, for another day trip. Um, we bought a GoPro. This is a GoPro. I've never had a GoPro, um, so this is a GoPro. This is the first of the GoPro. Uh, yeah, it's the first trout trip of the year. Uh, I'm heading out with Josh on the fly from uh, our pilot episode, actually. And uh, yeah, so right now I've just got all the stuff because we're taking out the water masters. So I'm just repacking and figuring out how many bags I can bring, which I'm trying to just bring one, maybe two. But I'm trying to be a vest guy again. I got a sweet new vest from Reddington. And uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna be a vest guy. Go back to the roots, the trout roots of vest guy. So yeah, I'm trying to do everything in the cooler and the bag before we hit the river. Uh, we're gonna go to the Yeah! Anybody who fishes with me knows I'm the uh, tippet uh, master. I always have too much, uh, so I'm gonna try to pare down, uh, keep my back up in the bag, and then keep that for the, you know, uh, uh, like the go. I always love having like a little go fly box and like 650 flies in my backup that I'm never gonna use. And same thing goes with my um, tippet. I have my go tippet and then uh, the one that I use the most, and then about like 400,000 yards of backup, you know, just in case I need to knit you a tippet sweater. Okay, cool, a little quick uh, little sponsor note, but I'll do it in the uh, <clears throat> form of advice. Probably no secret by now, we're sponsored by Costa and Chums. Um, when I'm packing up uh, for the day, the other thing I always try to do is uh, bring a couple of pairs of shades, because uh, you know I'm in a fortunate, privileged position, but if you are too, um, and you can have some different lenses, uh, a lot of lenses I like using in Ontario for freshwater, are the green mirrors, which actually are copper and amber on the inside. So it's great for cutting through uh, some glare, but also fish spotting and also safe wading um, and safe boating, which is great. Uh, so it works well in uh, obviously our tea stained rivers around here. The other thing that's pretty cool, this is the Lido, by the way, new, 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 2022, new Lido Pro. Um, these are the Reefton Pros uh, and they're the Sunrise Mirror, which for us in Southern Ontario, um, you know, we probably steelhead and trout fish in not so great conditions all the time. And what I mean by that is snow and rain. They were made for um, cloudy days and uh, low light conditions. So for those cloudy days, for those rainy days, and also for the morning and the evening, they really help lighten everything up. Um, they are yellow on the inside, almost like a shooting glass, and they just liven everything up. So yeah, if you, uh, if you can, uh, you know, bring a couple pairs of sunglasses, but if you can't, I'd say my all around go-to's for, um, you know, places uh, in and around uh, Southern Ontario, Ontario freshwater fishing in general, but also flats fishing are the green mirrors. Cause they work really well. I've, I've had these in the Bahamas and Texas and uh, they're, they're, they've been awesome for the marsh and the flats, uh, the green mirrors with the uh, amber and copper on the inside. Um, so yeah, that's the sponsor minute here. Um, I put them in my chum vault can fit two pairs of sunglasses in here. Very handy, it floats. So yeah, let's go to the river. Actually, no, I gotta tie flies. Gotta tie flies, tie some flies.
of. Got the water uh, filled up. Getting the car packed up. And go meet Josh. Yeah, see? Everything poorly organized. And uh, time to hit the road. Well, it's been an absolutely gorgeous day. Driving through the streets of Toronto. Uh, it takes just as long to get out of Toronto than it does to get to the river, so yeah, you know. But that's okay, you know. That's okay, you know. Got a shorter uh, commute today. Um, no, I don't have a longer commute. Here we are, halfway. Um, got Mac Alloway on, CBC Morning. It's a nice radio show, you know. Oh, Tim Morton's time. Uh, are you guys an iced coffee or a hot coffee kind of person? I'm so hot. I get your order. Uh, hi. Could I please have a sausage English muffin meal, breakfast meal thing? Sausage well, English muffin. You want a hash brown? Please, thanks. Yeah. Okay. And then what would you like to drink? Um, I'll have a a a a, 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 a medium dark roast double double. Sure. Anything else? Um, yeah, just um um an apple juice. Is that everything? <laughs> uh, yes, it is. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thirteen thirty. Yeah, it's an extraordinarily nice May day here, and uh, but I still go with a hot coffee. I, 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 in the morning, I don't know. Iced coffee seems like a midday kind of thing, you know. Anyway, bye. <laughs> We're raft guys now, Josh. Oh yeah. Big time reference. No more bankies for us. <laughs> okay. Josh, the two-way pump is really a game changer. Oh, absolutely. No more foot pump. I'm nope. not doing that. No offense, uh, Watermaster. But the foot pump is... It's compact. <laughs> <laughs> we'll give it that. It's compact. You're going for compact. It's great. Myself changing mid. Oh, yeah. I'm always changing mid. Uh... Oh, the anchor? She found that with this fish pond uh, Thunderhead submersible, I can just hang it off the front here and it actually becomes a really easy and waterproof storage for my cameras. Because what I'll do is I'll put my fly stuff here, I'll keep my boat bag back here, and then this way I'm not so concerned about the cameras. Um, I'll put a, you know, put the GoPro in here. I'll you know, put the waterproof housing on the GoPro, and then the drone. Everything's behind me, and we're off to the races, bud. Woo. Josh, the intrepid traveler. It's interesting when you can't see your feet. <laughs> Careful, Josh. Your feet. Fiberglass kind of day. Yours does it too. I don't know how my GoPro works. Josh, can you show us the fly or no? That's a big no. Oh, oh <laughs> that's oh a hard God. no. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, very nice. Right? You got this all sorted out, eh, bud? And he's off. Oh. Yeah, so freaking uh, water's moving a little quick, eh, bud? Gonna put on a sink tip here? Oh, yeah, she's moving real quick. Oh, I gotta help you get down, eh? Yeah. <laughs> You're like, I really, hate, I now hate fishing with you. <laughs> Last time I invited you out. No, you're stuck with me. I'm the only other guy with a raft. I know. <laughs> you have no option. That's it. <laughs> Do you want your net?
Oh yeah. Cheersies. Damn, look at this run. Josh, you want another one? Brownie? Nice. Oh, looks like a beef. Well, that was a demon. Oh, we caught the river demon today. Well, well, yeah. That was good, man. That was a fish and a half. Oh, God. And it hit the tail hook, so. What does that mean for you? I don't know. I have one on the front, one on the back. I still have no idea what I'm going to clip off. Well, well I think it's double regs or double hook regs. Good fish, man. Hitting the fast stuff, hey? Oh, right in the fast stuff. I thought they'd be chilling in the pools, but I spooked one on the way down that was in some pretty shallow riffles and there's a bunch of bugs coming off, so I figured one off and man, man, what a fish. What a fish. What a fish. Are you seeing this? Are you seeing this? We were gonna go home. But there's a huge spinner fall about to happen, I think. Wow. It's uh, last light here. Um, I just lost a beef or I think uh, Josh got it on video, but man, what a beautiful day. We've uh, got, a, got into with some fish. Tons of mayflies coming off. Beautiful sunny day. Like it's definitely the first Hot, like hot-ish week of spring. So it was nice. Josh got a beautiful fish. I got a couple. I got a rookie, so that was cool. Um, and yeah, I just got broken off by an absolute tank. It took me into those logs. Couldn't control them. Couldn't be tamed. Anyway, awesome day. Awesome day. And we're, I think we got a bend or two left in the river, and let's pack up the and get get home because it's getting dark. What a magic little evening this turned into. Ah, yeah. uh, this looks like a Blair, the Blair Witch Project now. Oh my goodness. Oh, uh, weird. Well, good day, dude. Mm -hmm. Good oh day. My God, great day. Solid day. Yeah, this looks so weird. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, ah. Um, okay, bye. Okay. Bye. Bye.